Hi guys, we're out here with Dylan and Aiden Easy. We wanted to shoot you a video in under two minutes and show the year five and six exactly how to warm up. It's really important on game days to make sure we do a full warm up. So these guys have generously volunteered their time to show us exactly what we need to do. All right, we'll keep it under two minutes. First, we need to jog around the court twice. So let's go for a quick run. As I said, these guys are gonna keep it pretty speedy. They've already had a training session. They're fully warmed up. So they're okay. They're gonna cut back in. Year five and six, we want you guys going all the way around the court. All right, warming up's important. We can actually get injured if we don't warm up properly. It also will affect our ability to start the match the way we want to. After doing our two laps, we need to start some stretching. So we start from the, the feet down, work our way up. So we start the ankles, quads, calves, work our way up the legs. Then we get to the upper body. Again, each stretch we need to hold for 30 seconds. So make sure if you're doing one arm, you do the other arm then for 30 seconds as well. One leg, 30 seconds, one muscle, 30 seconds, the other muscle, 30 seconds. After our stretching, we move straight into mini hitting. So this is a good opportunity to get our eye in, make sure we can see the ball, get our feet moving, and just hit the ball. It's just mini tennis, service line to service line. Of course, just like these guys are doing, we want to make sure we're hitting up the line. So we're only using half a court. After that, that should take two to four minutes. After that, we drop back full court. Again, by now we should be pretty warmed up in terms of our body, but we haven't actually hit any full court balls. So again, rally full court. Once you're ready, after maybe another two minutes, one player comes to the net while the other player stays back and make sure that we're warming up with one at the net, one at the back, up the line still. So we can have four players on one court warming up quite effectively. This is a routine warm up, not just for IGS, but pretty much for all players who are playing GPS. Next we go to smashing, so have some volleys at the net, then do some smashing. After that, both players have done that, you drop back, then we move into serving. So let's make sure we get some serves going, first serve, second serves. Let's start slow though, ease your way into it. Once we've done that, we're fully warmed up. So that's our warm up, hope year five and six. I hope you guys can use this video and we look forward to seeing you on game day and we hopefully will be able to see you using this warm-up. Thanks for watching.